Hey everybody, Brett from Astartes Gaming here, back with another episode of our Dawn of War 2 Let's Play. So, uh, we are on day 21, where we have one more deployment to go, thanks to the success of our last mission. And so, we have uh, effectively two choices. We can either take care of this brood swarm at Typhon Arena, or we can go into the hive at Landon Swampland. Now, these are the only two missions available to, available to us currently. Calderas is completely empty, as is Meridian. So... It really does come down to these two. I think I'm going to do the optional mission first. And if we have time today or in the next episode, we'll do the uh, story mission. Because this will actually advance things and change up a whole lot. So I feel like we're running on sort of like, uh, not borrowed time, like uh, extra time maybe. So I, I want to do this because I, I do think that this is going to add us or add several more missions to our uh, you know list of things to do. So, we'll go here first. Commander, the Tyranid Swarm continues to strike at vulnerable targets. A powerful Tyranid warrior has led its brood into shelters and other areas previously thought safe. The consequences on morale have been disastrous. Worse still, this outbreak, if not stamped out quickly, could destabilize the entire region. Eliminate this beast quickly to keep our holdings secure, and drive the swarm back. So we have to locate and destroy all the nests where the Tyranids are spawning from, as well as the Tyranid warrior leading this brood as well. There's several of them dotted all over the map, so we'll need to find them all. Uh, this victory will reduce infestation, as they always do. And it looks like there are synaptic generators that are enhancing Tyranid enemies, so we'll need to target those to weaken the enemy. I'm going to run with Aramis, Tarkus, Avidus, and Thaddeus. We're going to get to try out Thaddeus' new Terminator armor. Our reward is a power sword that I will probably sell immediately because it's terrible. So with that, let's go ahead and deploy. We are to tend to the fears of the masses now? No. We fight the enemy, wherever he hides. Be wary of ambushes. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try to get, uh, crap. Get in there, please. And if you could, uh, teleport on into here, that'd be great. No? Okay. Why, Thaddeus, why aren't you doing that? Come on. I don't know why he won't teleport. I think we're running into a similar bug that we've seen before. Where, uh... We can't jump pack or teleport or anything. Which is unfortunate, but... We'll make do. Go on. Let's see. You should probably heal yourself. Get to cover. And Aramis, I need you dealing with these big guys. If you don't mind. Okay, uh, can you get over there, please? Come on, go! Fight them! Alright, Aramis, once you're done with that guy, I need you over here. Finish that thing off. There we go. Alright, pull back a little bit. You're getting shot from down there, and that's not a fight we really need to be engaging in right now. If you could go harass them a little bit, that would be great. And then Aramis, I would love it if you could jump back for me. There we go. Perfect. Okay, we're finally making some headway here. Stay on those guys. Uh, let's have you clear this out. Okay, Tarkus, I need you shooting buildings, if you don't mind. Feel free to uh, get some frags in there, since they're free. Okay, you don't need to be on top of the damn thing, just start shooting. And you're useless to me there, so why don't you come over here. Start destroying these. Aramis, where the hell did you go? You're just standing there. Okay, well, 
tie them up while we destroy this. There we go. You're shooting that, that's fine, as long as we're destroying this stuff so they can't keep spawning. And then we'll deal with these guys down here. Okay, I'll let you handle that. Oh, we got a lictor down there. Okay, uh, let's see. Could you shoot them for me? I think we're gonna need some backup down here, so could you teleport to there? There we go. Uh, I'm gonna pop a heal. And why don't you go fight those guys for me? Come on, destroy it! Tarkus, make sure you're helping out. Who knew it would take so long? Alright, stun him. There you go. Stay on him, stay on him. There we go. Alright, you need to be like on top of those guys. Aramis, why don't you jump back in there as well? Oh boy. Uh, put a frag on them. Come on, frag. Oh, we lost the Terminator. Do you want to maybe kill that guy? Uh, oh, you're just standing around. Get in there. Let's see. You need to teleport into combat there. And why don't you merciless strike that thing? There we go. Gonna need to heal again. We'll have to replenish. Oh, that was a waste because we were out of range. Let's see. Move up, move up. Let's see. I'm gonna pull back. Because we're fighting way too many battles right now. Oh. Thaddeus is down. Aramis is down. Okay, well, we'll go get them in a second. Let's see. Get ready to frag them. There we go. Uh oh. Nice. It's a very effective use of the plasma cannon there. Can we just destroy this thing already? Like, how long does this take? Okay, the thing is finally done. Alright, now we need to start dealing with these guys. Uh, if you could keep lobbing grenades, that would be great. Ooh, some more power armor. Come on, need another frag. Right there would be fantastic. Good job. Alright, stay on them. If you could get into that building for me, that would be great. This is going to be very difficult to dig them out of that spot, but we have to do it. Let's see. Get to cover or something. Go ahead and shoot that. That'll slow them from spawning. If you could do that as well. No, it looks like you're... Oh, no, you can shoot it. Okay. As soon as we've destroyed this, we'll move him to that building. And that should allow us to kind of overwatch that position. Uh, if you could get a frag on them for me. No? Oh, you're out of energy. Alright, well. Can't be helped then. Okay. Hop out. Get in there. Let's get you into cover there. There's not really much cover there, unfortunately. Come on, shoot it. You really don't want to be fighting a lictor head up here. Yeah, you know what? That's not going to work. Holy hell. I might need you in that building. I don't see how you're going to survive otherwise. Come on, keep throwing frags. Just lob them everywhere. Frag everything. Under attack. 
Uh, did you throw it? I can't tell, to be honest. Come on. Come on, Avidix. I need you to do work here. Uh, great. You need to keep moving. You're getting surrounded here, which is not ideal. If you could put a frag on that, I might be able to save them. This is where Cyrus would have been a lot more useful. Okay, what are you doing? I need you killing something. Okay, go. Go for the rescue. While Tactical Advance is active, I think he's basically invulnerable to death, so we need to take that opportunity. Are you kidding me? He was just short. Okay, I don't know how we're going to make this work, but we're going to have to. Come on, light him up. Okay. I need you rescuing Tarkis. Good. Get Thaddeus back up. Come on. Okay, Tarkis, I need you resing people then. There we go. Let's get him back up. You need to... Let's start smashing these. Oh, go res him first. And we might fall back, actually. Because we need to replenish our numbers. Come on, frags. I need frags. All the frags. Thank you. Okay. Uh, pull back, pull back, pull back. Aramis, do not engage. I need you there. Uh, if you could move over there as well. Come on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, we gotta pull back. Okay, we're back on the move. We've replenished our numbers, and I've set up a turret here so that they can't continue to flank us because they were sending us a lot of trouble from that direction. Okay, I need you to move in. Get in there. Do we have a new target? Can you uh, teleport on in there as well? I need Avidus here and Tarkus there. Okay, come on, move, move, move. Nice, okay. Now we're in business. Uh, Aramis, focus on this first. Deal with the spawn points before anything else. Come on, go kill that. Quickly now. Tarkus, capture that so we can replenish our numbers as we fight. I need you there. I need you in here. And you guys are going to need to throw some frags in just a second. Okay, get a frag there. Okay. Big guy down yet? Can't tell. Let's see. Could you crack that open too while we're sitting here? Thank you. I need you to go destroy that, Aramis, if you could do that as well. Let's keep them from spawning on us. And it looks like we've dealt with the main sort of cluster. Uh, they just keep running right past it. I was hoping putting it there would it serve done. as enough of a choke point where we'd be alright, but it doesn't appear that that is the case. Okay, well, let's wipe this out, and then we'll push downhill toward the foundry and destroy the rest of those Tyranids. We could also go this way and attack here first, and that might be a better course of action than trying to attack across the water, although that does provide decent cover from those trees anyways. So we'll see. Let's go. It is done. Move on. Okay, there we 
we go. Let's keep moving. I'm gonna go this way. Because we keep getting attacked from this direction. I think it just makes more sense. Come on, somebody shoot that thing. Really? Thank you. Alright, keep moving. They continue to spawn in behind us. There's not a lot I can do about that. Devastator Marines ready for combat. We'll see if that helps any. Just to kind of slow them down. Come on. Call it in. There we go. Understood. Going there now. I think that thing should be able to handle them. There it is! Eliminate. Oh, there he is. Get over there. Air miss, I need you in there as well. Wow. Okay. Uh, I need frags everywhere. Ooh, nice. Oh, Jesus. Alright, get in there, please. That should help us a little bit. Uh, I don't know what happened to Tarkis, but let's get him out of melee. Please start shooting that. Let's see. Um, could use that. No, let's just stay on them over here. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay, Tarkis is down. Could you... Yeah, go over there, please. What are you doing? Uh, I need you here. Sit still, man. Okay. Uh, if you could res Tarkus real quick, that'd be great. Uh, I hate that they just ignore my melee characters and go right after my uh, squishy ones. Stop engaging in melee, dude. He went out of his way to hit somebody with his uh, plasma cannon right there. Okay. Over here. Clear them out. Is there a capture point around here that we can use? No. So we're going to use the drop pod then to get some reinforcements. I'm glad I saved it. Oh boy. Okay. Avidus, get in there. Um, Aramis, do me a favor, call in a drop pod there, if you could uh, teleport to here. Okay. Oh, great. Friendly fired our own guy. Somehow that hit the building. It didn't look like it was close enough, but whatever. Uh, where the hell are you? Could you get him back up, please? Okay, almost. There we go. I need you destroying that. Can we melt a bomb it? No, we can't. Let's see, Aramis, get over here. Oh no, no, stay on, stay on that guy. You're right. You're right. Oh, you're fine, Tarkus. We're almost done here. As soon as we can destroy this, I think that's pretty much game over. Yeah. Almost done. You should be shooting that. Did you just knock your own guy down? Alright, there it is. Those who fear death can emerge from beneath their beds now. Our fortifications are under assault. Victory is but a prelude to the next battle. Okay. So, we get our power sword. This is probably the least valuable loot that we came by in that mission. Uh, we're not going to get a very good score here, but it doesn't really matter because we had virtually no chance of getting another deployment anyways unless we were perfect. 
Uh, we did get several level ups though. That's what I like to see. And we acquired quite a bit of war gear. I have been studying chapter records, and these look to be the same Tyranids the Ultramarines defeated on Tarsus. They may very well be from that high fleet, Thaddeus. This is what makes the Tyranids so deadly. Only a few Hive ships need to escape a battle for the Hive fleet to survive. These few ships will go on to devour a few poorly defended worlds. This provides the biomass needed to replenish the Hive fleet and make it even larger given enough time. Every Hive fleet we have encountered has had the potential to topple the Imperium, and each one has the potential to spawn any number of splinter fleets if they escape to weaker sectors. Mark my words, Thaddeus. The Imperium has no shortage of deadly enemies, but they all pale in comparison to the Tyranids. Alright, so as I suspected, we got some new missions here. Although, really? Right back in the same area just to deal with the Carnifex? Okay. That's kind of dumb, but whatever. Do we get anything else? No. No. Okay, so just those two missions. Let's take care of our level ups and war gear. Alright, Aramis. Um, we definitely don't need these power swords, so let's get rid of them. I'll keep that one. You already have Indomitable. Let's get you No Mercy, No Respite. Cool. And I don't think you need an upgrade. Uh, actually, maybe. Let's see. Plus 100 health. That's just a straight upgrade from what he has now. So that's definitely worth it. These are good, but they don't have any bonuses. So they might not be worth keeping. We're definitely going to give you Isidore's Folly, though. Oh, look at all that gold on there. So much filigree. Did we really get a freaking chainsword? That's a really good chainsword, though. That is a damn good chainsword. Okay, Tarkus. Let's see. Do we have any upgrades for you? That actually might be better. Hold on here. Slightly less health, but more melee damage resistance, which is good for him because he's generally melee combat. More melee skill. Uh, all he loses on on that is the suppression resistance but it's oh it's actually lower armor rating yeah I think he's good with what he's got yeah I'll leave it there all right Tarkus I think I should give you tactical mastery technically he already has it because of his armor but as soon as he changes armor he may lose it this will ensure that that doesn't happen and then that wouldn't be too bad. I kind of want this as well. Gaining standard defensive benefits. I mean, that would make tactical advance really good. This would make it even better. Let's go ranged first. So your current armor has, what, 45? And the bonus is... I mean, the damage resistance is great and all, but this... Gives you a ton more health. So let's do that. I may just sell this, but we'll see. Avidus does need some armor as well, although I'd like to get him into some Terminator armor too, so that he can use an auto cannon. For now, let's give him Battle Lust. Not going to give him a missile launcher. And wow, I do not need that much Dreadnought armor. Let's see, these are rated 42, so even our worst armor currently equipped is still better than these, so they can all go. And, oh, he's capped out at 20. Right, I forgot they, they capped out at 20. So we unfortunately can't unlock anything else for him. And that's probably true of many of these guys. So there's actually no point in me selling this stuff, but I'm going to do it anyways just to remove the clutter from my inventory. And, well, actually, no, that's not true, because some of our guys aren't at the cap yet. It's just these three. Okay, so with all that stuff cleared out, let's take a look at Cyrus's gear now. That's a level 20 sniper rifle, which is pretty damn good. That level 18 one is almost as good, though. Actually, it's better, so there's no reason to keep this. He can equip this now, and that is... 
pretty much a straight upgrade, so let's do that. We'll get rid of Tellian's Chosen, which is, of course, a reference to Sergeant Tellian, the... Um, or actually, is he a captain? I think it's... Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Sergeant Tellian. He is one of the sergeants of the uh, Ultramarines 10th Company, the, the scout company. And let's see, let's see... Which one of these is better? Might of the Undying, Mall of Heretics... That doesn't sound like a good thing for us to be using. That's probably a lot better. Yeah. So we'll get rid of that heretical dreadnought arm. Uh, I don't need any pistols. Probably not going to be using a chainsword, even though that one is pretty damn good. And I'll have to see if that's an upgrade for Thaddeus, who just received a level up. We're going to go for Chapter's Fury. Sweet. We need to put, actually put one more point in there in order to ensure that we have it, you know, regardless of armor. That's not going to get us anywhere, but we don't have a lot of points left to spend. In fact, we only have one. Let's see. 161. That is better. That just looks to be overall better. So let's take that. And this one can get sold. Okay. So you are nearly... To level 19. In fact, I would be willing to maybe unload some of this stuff just to ensure that that happens. Probably not going to be giving anybody a power fist at this point, and that was enough to do it. And I'm not going to be using this sword either, so let's just toss it. Who am I kidding? All right. So I have two points to spend now, and then two more later. Let's see. That's not going to help us. We won't be able to get to here. Yeah, that's kind of a shame. Let's try that. Because it looks like, with his current armor, if we put two points into here, it may give us Master Infiltrate, even though we don't have the actual points invested in it. And I think that's all we can do today. So we've got three guys at level 20, and two at level 19. So we've almost maxed everyone out. I wonder if there's a mod that lets me level them indefinitely, because that would be kind of cool. But we'll see. We still haven't gotten uh, we still haven't gotten our dreadnought yet. So hopefully we get that soon. But anyways, we're gonna leave it here for today. So thank you guys so much for watching. I had a great time playing some Dawn of War 2 with you, and I look forward to seeing you guys back here for the next episode. <laughs>